I am Ace of Space for the win, and welcome back to part 23 of the Medbots playthrough. We're about to start the second part of the tournament against the Southern Kingdom Prince Kerr. Err, oh, this should be an intense battle. Against uh, the, these guys, of course, I would re-equip those wheel legs that you had to accommodate for the room feel type. I'd equip one of your Medbots with a grapple trap, and any other parts are your choosing. I, I am, of course, just going with missile types. So let's do this. You're just a recording, aren't you? To be replayed again and again to anyone that comes through here. Go fuck yourself. At least I've got a friendly face in the presence of Mr. Referee. Lovely br bloke. Finally, we can get this started at long last. Yay, the free people clap in apparition! Yeah. But seriously, I thought this was just a simple tournament, not a World Federation Championship. Here we go, Kerr. <laughs> Our hope is a pretty quick one, knowing me. <laughs> yeah, I don't understand you, mate. I don't have a dictionary for your country, whatever it is. Okay, um, wait a minute. Those are red matadors, the Spanish um, stereotypical metabot. I thought this guy was from some southern kingdom. This makes no sense. Actually, can somebody clarify that? Is the Southern Kingdom a place in Spain or something? Because I don't, I don't get it. Okay, so these guys' gimmicks is basically their only t kind of attack is, you know, close combat grapple moves. So if we basically, j bastard, if we basically just lay down a grapple trap, they won't be able to do jack shit to us. Although one annoying thing about them is they do have defensive type moves, so. As long as we have that um, grapple trap on, we'll be doing more damage than they are. See, they're not taking too much off us. There we go. We got that stupid shield. And they got the even more annoying one, which completely um, neutralizes damage altogether. Just wait until we've charged up the meta force, you dick. But yes, um, the Red Matador was uh, used by the Spain team, all the Spain team, who dressed the same, even though they should have never met each other in their lives. Oh, where's the originality gone on these things anymore? Eat missiles! Nope. I hate that. Oh well, at least his skill went up, even though he failed to hit the target. That doesn't make any sense. Hey, it's been a while since we've seen an epileptic cannon shot, hasn't it? I think for some reason I was trying to make her useful at this point in time, so I give her some shooting. I don't think it's really helping. Should have just made a heal turn. I was lucky that this guy um, defended that other one because otherwise the damage would have just been neutralized. Huzzah! Okay, here we go. Epileptic cheap cannon! Oh, I wonder if we'll get him. Oh, there goes an arm. Go for the head! Oh, you bastard. Right, okay then. You obviously don't want to see the rest of this, so let's just uh, skip forward ahead a bit. There we go. Eat another epileptic cannon and uh, retake. And it worked this time. Implode and go back to the southern kingdom. Kerr. Da 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 da. You know, I can I can say dribble as well if you want. That's that's go fuck yourself in my language. Ugh. I would be angry if I lost to this kid. Oh well, another win for me. Here we go, round two against um I can't remember who she is. Let's have a look at the claws. Uh okay. American boys are kinda cute. Well, that is completely wrong, because I am Japanese. Ugh. For this battle, equip your males with grapple, close combat moves. Make them a bit... You know, give them any moves that will make them go quicker. And for the female, equip um, the brass head part. You know, we'll be needing that later. Okay, without further ado, let's go against this unidentifiable foreigner. I'm not even talking about that guy anymore. 
Hey, look, it's Tariq in the stand. I never noticed that. How long have you been spying on me? Italian! I totally didn't get that. Oh well. Trademark glasses, but what? I've never heard of her. Who is she? Ugh. Metabotza are some most uh, popular in Italia. Is that real Italian? Seriously? Or is it just that fake one that all those foreigners do to make fun of them? And even more stranger... Have you noticed the Metabots? These are not Italian stereotype Metabots. These are Egyptian stereotype Metabots. Okay, actually these are pretty dangerous. Um, their main attack of defense is Napalm, which is very deadly. It's, more, it's like a more powerful missile. And worst of all, they've got high armor as well. So our best bet is to lay down some shot traps and uh, hope for the best with our close combat. Ha ha ha. Here we go, watch this. Napalm! Seriously, Napalm! In a, in, a, in a children's event. Napalm is bloody dangerous and they're allowing these kids, quote unquote, toys to use them. <sighs> Imagine if this was real to be an epileptic fit from soccer mums about it. See, look at this. 130, that's pretty decent. Bastards. They hate when they have strong leg parts. You never get to the bodies. So anyway, what you want this um, female to do is keep using the head part to raise your accuracy. So to, just to make sure you can hit better. Again, these are original ones, which is very strange because there was a stereotypical Egyptian one in the show. But of course this makes no sense because our person here is Italian. Whatever. You don't belong in this world. Die. There we go. Another stereotype who isn't a stereotype. Defeated. Look at that, I had to kill all of them as well. It's not fair. Cleopatra, that was the stereotypical metabot for um, Egypt. Ooh, that should be pretty useful. So the female as well. Huzzah! It's a great. I'm gonna go eat some pasta, because I'm Italian, of course, that's all I eat. Mamma mia! Yeah, whatever. Fuck it. Here's our next opponent. Guess the stereotype. Yeah, you better not go easy on me. I bet you've watched a few animes in your lifetime. It's so hot in here, so could he be from a cold country? For this battle, I advise giving the guard armor head parts. You can win these from row battles outside of the tournament building. And uh, again, equip her with the accuracy head parts. Also, uh, if you can, put a grapple trap on one of your male meta parts as well. Without further ado, let's go on. Yeah, whatever. Basically, any meta parts that, are, that help accuracy. Right, um, let's get this going. Heat 4. Da -da -da -da. Oh, the Russian one, of course. I should have guessed by the nose. So he, so he likes cold things. No. Uh, I'll probably just heat him up a bit. Flame throw, motherfucker. Yeah, whatever, let's do this. Leroy Jenkins, this shit. Okay, so the problem with these metabots is... Actually, hold on, I'll just wait, wait for the battle to start. Just charge up, get that grapple trap down, and use that accuracy increase in head pop. Okay, so the problem with these metabots is they're pretty quick, and their attack tabs are freezing. And of course, as you know, freezing is bad, because that will make our moves go much slower. Luckily for us, these guard armor head parts will stop any status effects that are used against us. And that's pretty much them taken care of, as their attacks aren't that strong. The problem is though, they are pretty quick metabots, so if you try to attack them with other parts, they're more likely to dodge them. So, if we use the brass head part to increase their accuracy, or if you've got any missiles, which are 100% accuracy anyway, you should be able to take them down pretty easily. And with the grapple trap, they'll go even down even quicker. But of course, they didn't go down quick enough to let me put in the entire battle, so let's skip forward a bit. Bloody hell, that was a lot. Of course, I didn't equip her with any guard armor, she's fucked. No! 
Yeah, it's a real shame. And I guess that's the counterpart. They're very hard to hit, but their armor's pretty weak. Ha ha! Yes, you did lose. Now, how come I keep getting head parts for my female? I need some arms, damn it. Yay, battle leveled up. Uh, was there any other outcome? You can't really retrain Metabots, they only are machines. You can do try if you want, but it's not going to help you much. And who's that stereotype waiting for me down there? Join me in part 24 where we find out. Till next time.